Hello everyone, today we look at the most beautiful places of Portimao on the coastline of the southern part of Portugal. You will see amazing beaches, hidden sands and the best spots for photo. I add the names accordingly to the places that you will see. Of every spot I will make a separate more in depth. Praia da Rocha and Praia dos Tres Castelos are the first sands to explore. These beaches are right at the promenade of Portimao. There are stairways to these large beaches, very family friendly beaches with golden sand. Much space to relax and enjoy the waves while you behold the rocks that are nearby and to explore the caves and holes in the rock. Praia do Amado and Praia dos Carianos are just next to the ones before. You can walk at low tide from Praia da Rocha more to the west to Praia da Vau. But you can also walk on the trails that run on the rocks just next to the beach. From these trails you have perfect views over the coastline and you can choose your favorite spot because there is always easy access to the sands. More to the west are Praia do Vau and Praia do Alemão. From there you have a wonderful sight on the dispersed rocks. There is a rock with the name Rocha do Leo or Lion's Rock. And again you have caves and holes to explore. The views here are so nice with the scattered rocks. The sea shows different colors and today there is algae on the beach. On another day all algae were disappeared due to the tides. Now we will look at the places that are more difficult to reach. The hidden beaches, the very calm amazing spots where the nature is overwhelmingly beautiful. These beaches are best to reach from the walking trails on the rocks and then you descend via small hiking paths. There it is quiet with very few people and lots of birds. On the rocks you have stunning views and the seagulls are floating by all the time. It's a real spectacle to see them float above the rocky coastline.
Next is Praia da Prainha, our number one beach of the Portimao region. This place has so many caves and holes in the rocks, it is really a pleasant spot to discover all the most beautiful pieces while having the sound of the crashing waves on the shore. When you go for photos, go before noon or late in the evening, when it is not too busy. If you want to see a whole other area, then visit Passagissus di Alvor. This is a hiking trail on a wooden walkway that stretches over a nature park. You have far distance views and there is a small port. The ecosystem is very different to what we have seen before. Here are almost no rocks. The surface has many different colors and most of the space is covered with waters. Now we will explore more on the east side of Portimao. As you can see on the map, it is one beach next to each other. The first beach we look at is Praia do Paraíso or Paradise Beach and we will walk along the coast to Praia dos Tres Castelos. It was rainy and cold that day and a lot of wind. The beach has a nice stairway to it. On a sunny day this must be an amazing spot to relax and enjoy the waves, the ocean, the rocks and the surroundings. As we went a bit more to the west, we found another wonderful spot between the rocks. The beach that got our attention was Praia dos Tres Castelos. It has the same name as the beach on the promenade of Portimao, but it is of course a whole other beach. Not easy to walk down the trail. The last part you need to take a ladder to reach the sandy beach. More to the east is Praia do Valle de Centenis, a wonderful big beach easy to reach via a long stairway next to a beautiful hotel with a green zone. In another video we discover nice places in Lagos and Albufera, so make sure to subscribe if you are interested. Fantastic beaches are waiting for you. The Algarve has so many to offer. On the coastline, boats, kayaks, subboards and canoes are passing by to explore the caves. Of every place in this video I will make a separate video. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss it. I will also post the best spots of Albufera, Benagil and Lagos. Music